it's moving day. We're leaving. <laughs> no, we're not. Oh, yeah, the car's outside. Huh? So now we're going to throw away packages. And then we're going to get a new phone. And then moving day is officially starting. So, here I am. <laughs> um, looks weird. What is that? Okay, so it's moving day, like I said. And I'm really starting to get bothered by this thing. Whatever. So, it's moving day. It's Saturday the 2nd of February and we're right now currently driving with all of our like shit to just like throw away and then after that we're going to a store get a new phone because Rasmus phone broke and then after that we're going back to my parents house to have a little my parent my dad's brother is there and Rasmus is gonna call some like what are you calling electricity electricity whatever electrician and then we're going to our old apartment to like gather up all of the boxes and organize the last couple of things because i mean we're almost there but we still need to put some things in bags or like boxes or whatever and then after that we get our new apartment at three so at three we will be at the new apartment ready to paint because the walls are a little dirty in some places and I'm one of those people like I cannot stand that so we want the apartment to be fresh looking clean you know so that's what we're gonna do so I think that's the plan for today today the focus will be on painting and then tomorrow the focus will be on moving all the boxes and all of the like furniture and stuff so we have quite a few we have a few hectic days in front of us and then on Monday I think we're gonna be organizing all of the things and on Tuesday morning we're going to Cape Town so that's why it's like a little intense because we do need to move before Tuesday okay Ras do you need help we're borrowing we don't have a car so we're borrowing Rasmus brother's car and it's an old shit car so it's so small and tiny so this is like my, this will not be my comeback video on YouTube, it will be my second video on YouTube that will be up. And I'm super excited to be back and I hope you like the other video and I hope you will like this one. And if it is a little bit chaotic, I am sorry in advance because you know, I don't know how I'm going to work this out. But I am going to do a moving vlog because so many of you have asked about it and because I think it will be fun. Uh, so you guys will get to see the apartment, you might not get to see like 100% the finished result because it's not going to be finished when we leave on Tuesday So we will now have an office and the office room won't be finished at all Like we don't have anything for the office I have no idea how I want the new apartment to like look like how I want to furnish it But um, I guess that will just be like I'll sort it out as it comes But yeah So now maybe I should help Russ so we can get this party started I'll get back to you soon so now we are, Rasmus just left because he had to go and return the phone we just bought because they packed the wrong one. And this is our apartment, our own apartment. It's messy and chaotic. So mom and dad are coming to help us pack like their last stuff. And then we will go down and eat lunch. This is the current situation, like a lot of boxes. I'm walking with shoes inside, which you don't do in Sweden. Here is our living room. Okay, so let me tell you a story. This table right here, the one right there, had a big glass. So it was a glass table. This um, carpet had been under here. And we were sitting watching Scream, and I did not get that scared, but somehow I managed to push my feet so the glass just shattered all over the floor. So now it's standing up there, and the carpet is rolled in a little sausage, and we don't really know what to do with it. But I think we're actually gonna sell this table and get a new table because the glass was a little bit annoying Because I felt like dust kind of like got collected on the glass So it looked dirty even though it wasn't dirty. You know what I mean? But we're bringing the lamp with us. It's my favorite vintage lamp. The couch is actually Ikea, but it's like the most comfortable couch ever um, I definitely need to show you guys our new apartment when it's all finished because otherwise you'll get scared of me because this is not what it usually looks like 
So now I just need to like take off all of the covers from like the couch and stuff because we need to clean it. So we've been living at my parents' apartment this week because we have been moving and I just felt like I slept at home for like the first two days and then after the first two days I just got so stressed because the boxes were everywhere. Like we started packing down the kitchen and everything was just a little bit too stressful for me. So I decided to just sleep at my parents' house to, you know, not wake up and be stressed. Yeah. So, and I'm wearing a, like a boiler suit kind of thing from a Swedish brand called Big Book. It is old collection, so it's probably sold out. But it's really comfortable. I just want to be comfy today when we're moving and not wear jeans that just hug in, you know? <laughs> so the reason we're moving is because this apartment has been really nice. It's a really cute first apartment for us, but we just needed something bigger and we needed like a separate room to have our office in. Um, yeah, so we just wanted like our own office. Like right now we've been, when we, cause we do work from home, like always. Um, so it was just really annoying to just work from the kitchen table and it got so messy. Like we wanted to have lunch and it was like important papers everywhere. So we just kind of felt like we needed an apartment with an office. So we started searching and we found one really quickly. So it's a rental apartment. We're not buying an apartment right now because we don't really know where we want to live. So until then, we're just renting apartments. It works for us, but eventually I guess we're gonna want our own place. Cause you know, like when you're renting an apartment, you kind of always have to ask before you like do stuff. Um, like the apartment we live in now, I painted the closet pink. I'll show you guys later. And thankfully, um, it's my best friend's little sister who's moving into this apartment and she wanted the, she wanted the walls to be pink still. Otherwise we would have had to paint that white. So like you have to do stuff like that, you know, when you're renting, like you have to always ask, um, like if you own an apartment, you can just do stuff, you know, like as much as you want. This is the situation right now. I don't know if this vlog will be really messy, but at least I'm vlogging, at least I'm trying. Can you do that? Yes, I thought that was glass or something in it. So now we're moving a little bit. Down here, I'll show you the pink room. So this has been our bedroom. I'm not gonna show too much. This has been our closet, my little walk-in closet kind of thing. It's been really good to have, but now it's like, I'm happy to leave it behind. Okay, so we're in the car again, and I just need to buckle up. So we're in the car again, now we've just had lunch at my parents' place, now we're going back to our old apartment that I recorded before, and we will have a cleaner coming there. She's gonna check out the apartment, see how much time she will need to clean it, and then hopefully she will want to clean it this week. After that, it's almost three o'clock, it's three o'clock in a little less than an hour, and that's when we get the keys to her new place. And that's when we can finally start painting the walls and i just wanted to like be right now i just want to start because now i kind of feel like this middle part where i don't i can't do anything i'm just waiting for things to happen i'm wearing a cozy shirt also from monkey you know you gotta stay cozy in this winter wonderland we're excited i just want to get the keys because i think when we get the keys everything will feel more real and i'll be able to see if the apartment is nice and clean if like where we're gonna have our furniture and yeah everything will just start the ball will start rolling i feel like all i do is talk in this vlog i don't know if it's gonna be i don't know what's gonna happen and for everyone wondering how my bangs stay up when my hair is greasy it stays up that's my trick for you guys if you want to put your hair up when you have bangs just let it be a little greasy okay now I need to put my phone down because we're gonna meet her. So now, post chaos. Are we finished? Okay. So, post cleaning chaos, we've got all the paper on the floor, we're ready to clean it. Here's Dad helping me being a hero. So good. Hi, Dad. Hi. <laughs> so, yeah, we're gonna start cleaning soon, and then we have to be home by 8 because we're watching the Beat the Song. Daddy, cool. Doing something. 
<laughs> what is strike feeling? <laughs> Ras was in his dad painting. Is it fun, Ras? <laughs> We're checking to see if we painted the walls okay in the dark. <laughs> But I don't think we're halfway there. But it's blue skies. The face blue in it. Wow. And our living room, my friend Johanna, <laughs> that's her feet, is here. And she did inside my little living room. So now it looks like this. Obviously, like, we don't have anything. Like, this is just the base of the couch. So, yeah. We're waiting for the rest of our furniture and then we're gonna continue. But now we're drinking coffee, eating cinnamon buns and just relaxing a little bit, taking a breath because it's been a long day, let me tell you. Good morning from a very confused Matilda so this is where I got ready today so my little products right here mirror in the <laughs> window because I don't have anywhere else to get ready but now I'm gonna go and get dressed and then I'm gonna do like a little sit down video and then I think we're gonna wrap this vlog up so about like six months ago I think I asked you guys where do I find the cutest posters for my apartment so many of you mentioned that I needed to check out Desenio so I did and then I managed to do a little collaboration with them and give you guys a code so you could all um, shop. So the code is JERF and it gives you 25% off from the 19th to the 21st. So this is one of my favorite posters that I found. It says Visit Miami. It's in like pastel colors. I'm, I have it in a wooden frame, which I personally feel like looks really good with the rest of my apartment. So I just put this up. I'm probably not gonna have the bag there. That's my grandmother's bag that my grandfather gave her and I get to borrow it. It's my favorite vintage bag, just cause like the story behind it. Um, but I'm probably gonna do like put maybe like, um, cause I have a lot of dried flowers. Maybe I'll put that over there and then, you know, this is just temporarily, but I will always have the poster there though. Cause I feel like it really like collect, I don't know. I really like how it looks with the rest of the bedroom. Like it puts a little color into it, which I really like. So then we have these two that I don't really know where I want to put. So this one says Simp California, which I really feel, you know, is me. <laughs> Not that I'm a good surfer, but. And then this one, which is just like super simple. I want to have these two together, but I don't know like where. Okay, so this is in our kitchen. We have like a space where it's literally empty. So I think I want these two posters to be here because I feel like it kind of adds more life into the kitchen and then eventually I'll put, I don't really know what I want here. Um, but I wanted to show you guys these ones as well. So these are from a brand called Studio Arhoy. From, I got them in Denmark. I think they're so pretty. Like the colors, like look at this one. And these look really good together with the poster. So I'm gonna put the, these somewhere here, but now I just put them over there to show you guys. 
but yeah this is that's the posters that i got from decenio i hope you guys thought they were nice let me know which one you like the most i feel like i love the surf california and visit miami one because they're so like vintage retro with the colors and like the um and the print so i feel like that's really neat okay so this i guess will be like the last i'm gonna wrap this little vlog up um and to like explain it all a little bit further we started moving in on saturday at saturday at three o'clock we were supposed to get the keys to the new apartment and the key, like the apartment was supposed to be clean um because you know when you move out of a new apartment you like deep clean it you know like the bathroom like everything i think you guys if you moved before you know if you haven't moved before it's just the way it goes like you wouldn't want to move into an apartment that is <laughs> You wouldn't want to move into an apartment that is dirty from the people who lived there before, whom you also don't know. So you clean it. We got here at 3 o'clock. The apartment wasn't clean. Like, it wasn't even vacuumed. Like, they hadn't put in any effort. They've just basically moved out all of their stuff and then, you know, left. So we, I think we spent in total maybe like eight hours cleaning the apartment. I mean, like, when we moved in. The bathroom like imagine cleaning after another like cleaning another person's bathroom it's like walking into mcdonald's and cleaning a bathroom like you don't know who's been there you know what i mean it's really it's disgusting so we had to like scrub the floors like the whole kitchen we had to like wipe down the whole kitchen all of the rooms we had to deep clean it all and i think we wasn't we weren't prepared for that we were prepared to move into a clean apartment and you know then we would like, we knew that we would have to vacuum the floors after we moved all the boxes and furniture and stuff, but that was about it. So we spent, oh uh, yeah, like I said, like eight hours in total of time that we were supposed to spend like painting the walls, moving all the furniture, unpacking boxes. So we are not 100% finished yet. The, thankfully we have a room that's going to be the office, but thankfully we can just put all the boxes there and just close the door and pretend like live in denial that we are done. Um, but yeah, it's been a long week, a long weekend, but it's been a long week, let me tell you. And um, it's now Monday, tomorrow afternoon we are going to Cape Town, so today I need to, you know, pack the bags. Finish another vlog that I started before I started this vlog, and you know, just organize the last couple of stuff. And then tonight I have Reformer, which I'm really looking forward to, just to be able to like go into myself for an hour and focus on everything, but how funny, I was gonna swear, how stressed I am. So yeah, but I hope you liked this video. I know it was a bit like choppy maybe and I had planned on doing a better movie vlog but then when the situation appeared that we had to you know, do so much more with the movie than we were, thought we would have had to do, I did not have as much time as I wanted to to move. But I hope you liked it. I will show you guys in another video the final and like finished result. Maybe I can do like a progress video like that so like from my thoughts to like finished result maybe that would be fun i don't know um and then yeah we're gonna like everything will kind of fall into place when it does like i don't want to rush this and i don't have time to finish the apartment as much as i would want to after cape town i'm going away for another campaign and then after that i'm going to manchester to shoot ecom so i won't be home in february all that much but the dress i'm wearing is from lee apart Le Apt. I don't know how to pronounce it, but I tagged it on my Instagram when I'm wearing it, so you can go there. Um, my hair is crazy. I washed it last night. I fell asleep with it wet, so it is what it is. No products in it. Just I just let it air dry. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching this video, guys. I hope you're happy that you know I'm back. Um, I'm going to Cape Town. I will record there, and then. Um, a new get ready with me video will be coming i did one and then i accidentally deleted all the files so okay love you